Hey everybody, I want to show you my uh, my additions to the shelf that I bought. This is a plastic shelf I got, I think, from Sam's. Really sturdy, really cheap, really easy to build. And I'm growing me some uh, sprouts. Those are sunflower sprouts, and I've been eating those pretty good. Just grabbing them a few at a time. And this is the best I've done. I've tried to grow them before. They grew taller, but not everyone hatched. And what it was, was I think, I tried to get fancy with the soil. And uh, I put some worm castings in it. Watch too much John Kohler, I guess. But anyway, it does better with just regular potting soil. And I've, I had this light. This is a $10 light, grow light. You can get at Walmart. Go to the fluorescent bulbs and look for a green packaging. This is a grow light. It'll say grow light, it'll be green. It's ten dollars. It's meant to go under the counter in your kitchen under the cabinet. So it's good for close-up. So I had one, went ahead and added two. Made it two. I added another one to give it two. And uh, I've got some black tubs here uh, that I'm going to put on there to do kind of a... I might to do a hydroponic thing. I'm going hydroponics on here. I want to grow some uh, pack, pack, um, bok choy, pak choy, whatever hell you want to call it. And I might do some mason jar. You see some mason jars down here. Mason jar hydroponics. Um, I've got these cups. These are little five ounce cups to quite brand from Walmart and you get a soldering iron you poke holes in it make them into neck cups and they fit perfectly in a mason jar see that so you can put your little plant in there with rock wool and do the crack crack key method but I'm also wanting to do deep water culture with these bins down here uh, that means putting an air pump with an aerator stone in it that way and keep filling it up. Anyway, that's an update of some of the things I'm doing. I'm working on this. I'll keep you updated. This is Eat for Jesus Rick. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel.